and my brother come up to me and he grabbed me he says Cheryl the, the last wall just fell in and nobody made it out. September 23rd 2012 Cheryl Daniels life changed forever. Her parents Bubba and Molly McLaren were killed in a house fire and at the time she thought her children Chloe Leverett and Gage Daniel were too. It's chaotic it was really shock I just remember just being in shock. Investigators found the remains of Bubba and Molly and brought in forensics anthropologists to search for Chloe and Gage. Days passed. They used helicopters and cadaver dogs and still could not find them. Some of the best fire investigators in the country could not find evidence that Chloe and Gage were in the fire. The remains of their small dog and bird were found and still no signs of the children. Called me in for a polygraph and I took it and I passed it and they came out and that's when the TV had told me that uh, Chloe and Gage were not in the house fire giving Cheryl hope. You know, it's like, oh, they know they're out there, you know, they'll find them in a couple of days, and then a couple of weeks, and then a couple of years, and here we are now. Eight years, five months, 26 days later, Cheryl still has not seen her children. It's been hell, a nightmarish, heartbreaking hell. The TBI still has an active Amber Alert issued and released New Age Progression pictures last year. Cheryl believes someone close to the family came in and took her children that night. It had to be someone that knew them that was familiar because you just wouldn't know they were there unless you had been out there. Her children's story has caught national attention. The popular TV series Unsolved Mysteries is now available in podcast form and they picked up the story which became available Wednesday. Was it arson? And if it was, who set the fire? And where are the missing children? That's a lot of people who listen to that, who watch that. This gives Cheryl a rejuvenated sense of hope and that the mystery will be solved.